Hey everybody, welcome back to A Plague Tale Innocence. Robert Rambles here. Thanks for joining me today. We are still trapped in the courtyard here as poor Hugo, who is trying to mount a one-man rescue mission for his mother. We've been after him but weeks. he got captured. But he we broke out. Turns up here asking to see his mother. Huh. Yeah, see, they're telling you what happened. <laughs> it seems he has a sense of humor that he won't be keeping for long. They don't know that I we're out. To go and see his mother myself. They think we're still captive. We've that? been out for like an hour. But news travels slowly in 14th century France, so... They think we're still in our cage. Oh god. Huh? What was that? Okay. Same kind of issue as we were having last time. Uh, there's just a lot of people everywhere. Like there's people sitting on benches, there's people in the garden. We've been after him for weeks. And then he simply turns up here asking to see his mother. I think we have to get across all the way across into the wings over there. He has a sense of humor. That he won't be keeping for long. Maybe we can go this way, but I think there's a guy right here, right? See his mother no, he got up. What's he going to do with her? Let's go this way, it seems safer. Except for that guy right down there at the end. But he seems to be, like... Thankfully, he coincidentally is just kind of looking slightly the other way. And we'll definitely take that. I hope he doesn't start pathing this way, though. Unfortunately, where we're at here, I can't see much beyond this one guy. Let's see if we can get a better view. Shit. That's a better view, but not one we wanted. This guy doesn't seem like he's going anywhere. So let's cut through here. Our footsteps in the snow sound so being loud that I just keep waiting for these guys to hear us when we're right behind them, but I guess when you wear a steel helmet, it might do something to your ability to hear quiet sounds. We'll go with that. What is it? Um, what? Okay, he sensed something, but let's just get over here and hope for the best. Okay, I had a feeling it wasn't going to be that happen. Captain, uh, I was told that the carrier of the macula is here. Is that yeah. right? The child turned himself. It makes sense before. that we have to find another way. Apparently, How long can we just follow right behind him so easily? This seems like a precarious room to navigate. Is As he, I was yep, telling he's you, talking to somebody. This guard was devoured, but not completely. His bones. Oh. Don't walk right up to the guys that blend into the benches. Okay, we know we're not going to be able to follow him. Let's just go up here. As I was telling you, this guard was devoured, but not completely. His bones were cut up and taken away by the rats. Lovely. For what purpose? We don't to know. To incorporate them into oh, that into material. Oh, the, the creep. They build the creep out of it. Everywhere. It's not just rats. You poop. mean their nests? It's human parts. They right? use our dead to build their nests. Precisely. And if we do nothing. At the rate the dead are accumulating, the nests will eventually join together to form one giant nest. Beautiful. It's just a matter of time. 
That's so let us pray horrifying, that right? Vitalis' conjuration ceremony will indeed take place. Where is he? I won't find Mammy. When yeah. you think about what's going on and the kinds of things we've seen and been subjected to, I can completely believe people kind of losing their minds and being willing to go along with any plan that somebody who seems competent offers them, even if it involves a lot of gruesome and terrible shit. Because the world is full of gruesome and terrible shit at the moment. There are rats making nests out of human parts. So the fact that they would follow this Grand Inquisitor guy because he seems to have a plan, uh, it doesn't actually surprise me when I think about it. Because the world is already nuts. Okay, speaking of rats. They have some. Which I guess they would to study. Doesn't seem like a good idea. We are not going to be able to take advantage of it the way we might. Uh, oh, or are we? It's rats. Uh, tell me. Your Why numbers. can't I hear you like the others? Seeing as we have to transport Why can't I hear them. you You have like nothing to fear from them. Meticulous crossbreeding and a little alchemy has tempered their instincts. Not to mention a, a radical change of diet. <sighs> good. So... They're doing experiments on the rats, and Hugo says he can't hear these hairless, non, non red eyed looking ones. What about these ones? No, he can't hear these either, I guess. So they're breeding them. They are trying to change them. Is this guy asleep, or is he staring at the ground? Uh, he's not asleep. Although I could swear I hear somebody snoring. I don't know. Maybe my imagination. We can't get through this way though, can we? Absolutely not. Well, well. What do we have here? I don't know. Where are you coming from? He's just gonna walk right over and grab us? No, he's not. He just... He just walked right past us. Um, this seems close. Uh, let's pretend we're invisible. So there's nothing here. Absolutely nothing, guard. All right. Move along. Move along here. Oh, okay. It's totally fine. Don't sprint around even when you don't think they can see you. I'm going to have to risk, like, the fact hey, that... Hey, kid. Help me. Oh, no, no. Help no. me. No, shush. What's wrong with him now? Shush. Hey, you. Die quietly. All right, so don't walk out right then. I saw where we needed to go. That's a good thing. Uh, it's rats. Uh, tell me. Why can't I hear you like the others? Rats. Seeing as we have to transport them. You have nothing to fear from them. Meticulous crossbreeding and a little alchemy has tempered their instincts. Not to mention... Hey, kid. Diet. Help me. No. Help me. Good. What's wrong with him now? Hey, no. die quietly. I'm trying to work here. I'd rather he waited a little while. Rats prefer fresh meat. Damn you. You don't go to hell. You, you and your fucking rats. Oh, shit. Save oh. this respite. Shit. Okay. Your death uh, is these not guys are dead, aren't they? For your blood shall nourish a new yeah. race of angels. These guys are unfortunately they very dead. They shall be your children, your pride. Okay, it's let's. Horrible. It's him. He's going to get mommy. Let's cut over here. Oh, that's convenient. Don't shut that door in our face. Don't shut that door in our face. Thank you. No door. Not even a sliding one. I don't want to get too close to him. If she sees her son with a knife to his throat. And we're making sure that exact thing can happen by coming here. But Hugo as a five-year-old wouldn't think about that. He wouldn't think about the fact he's probably the only leverage that they could possibly have over his mother. So, can't really blame him. And unfortunately, we have to walk him right into the trap. That the rune woman is gonna suffer, I'd say. Huh. Serves her right. Uh, such an educated woman. She should have joined our side. Oh, no. She's way too stubborn. But no match for our torture. He can't get out. Ah, uh, please. At least let me 
die out there. You wouldn't like it out there, believe me. At least here your carcass can still be of value to our alchemists. Think yourself lucky. I'm oh, sure he does. Bastard. Real lucky. Okay. You guys just all keep quiet hey, now. Kid, what the hell are you doing here? Shh. I have to find my mommy. It's a stealth mission. Even the prisoners know it's a bad idea. Magistrate, he's talking to mommy. The last time, will you answer my questions? Or perhaps you are still upset about what happened to your husband? Right. Our torturer will take care of you. You'll soon have your voice back. Mark my words. Oh no, he's coming back. Hide. Uh, we're hidden enough, I think. But thank you for the prompting. Mummy? Uh-uh. Mommy? Hugo? But, but... So they... Amicia said you were dead, but you're not! Amicia... My darling... You must go... If they find you here... No! I'm staying with you! Oh, Hugo... Did they take your blood? Oh my god... All right, Hugo. We'll go together. But you have to find the keys. They must keep them in the room at the end of the corridor. Can you make it there? We've made it this far. Somehow. Well, we'll trial and error. Off you go, then. Go. Be very careful. Come back as soon as you have the keys. When I return, I want everything prepared and ready to begin. Do you understand? Yes, Lord Nicholas. All right, you heard him. Everything will be ready. The alchemist will talk. I'm going to enjoy it. Just do your job. The captain of the guard doesn't appreciate improvisation, and neither do I. Uh, yes, of course. Let me know when you're ready. I have to meet them here. Right. This might give me a promotion. Authority, results. I thought you were right to be efficient. Not the room no, woman has the skin of a real lady. So soft. Anyway. Creepy. The knives are sharpened. Anyway. The pliers, vibrant, so everything is ready. Have I forgotten anything? Hmm. With the captain around, the best double check. Are, is there a reason to be doing this? Probably not. Probably not at this point. They said we have to make them leave. If only Misha was here. No, I don't need her. Yeah, that's kind of what I was thinking, though. If only Amishi were here, the character we've been controlling for the majority of the game. Uh, with all the tools and upgrades we have, and all the skills we have learned, if only she were here, so that we could use her doing what seems a, a critical moment in the game. But she's not, so we have Hugo. I don't see that we're like getting down over this way. Oh, the rats. They're all afraid of rats. If I can just free them. Right. Yes. Yes, free the rats, little rat boy. Free the rats. Oh, they are your friends. Talk to them and free them. I don't have great feelings about what's going on with Hugo. Um, I guess we kind of always knew that he could hear the rats or sense them, but then he can actually talk to them? Like, I don't know. We'll see if he can actually control them. I did have a pop-up here. I swear I had some kind of toggle to activate it or something, but then it went away. 
So maybe this is not the right place. Let's let's backtrack. Um, yeah, the rats are right there in the cage. You'd think I could just push this thing over. No? Okay. Mm, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Let's flip this on for a minute. Uh, I just want to make sure there's nothing here because I see rats. I see a cage. I see a chain. I saw a pop-up indicating that I could press something and now I see nothing. So it's a little concerning. Let's just go down here with the rats. They probably won't eat us. We're the rat king. Oh, oh look at that. Let's just pull it. Come on. Quick, quick. Hey, the cage broke. Chief, we need to go. Move, move. Well done. Go away. Quickly now. The key. And now, where are we going to find the key? It was, it, Mom said it was the end of the corridor. Um, I guess we can I've just follow them. Back. I have to move the rats. Um, we have to move the rats. Sure. Why not? We can move lanterns. the rats. They don't and... like lanterns. Find the key. Oh, it works. Shoo. Okay. Ah, uh, don't look. Don't look. Okay, I see it. I see it. Now, just in case, I do want to turn that back off. Oh, shit. Stop shouting. All right, I guess we're okay. Oh, shit. Um, we can get out. We might need this. Actually, we're going to need the other one, aren't we? Oh, damn. Wait a minute. Why are they all in the light? What the hell? Okay, well... well they can still get by. I have to get them out of there. Oh, we Maybe can't with the other lantern. trust the, the lights. Uh, some kind of light of sight blocked the effect. How about that? Almost. I hope this works. I guess they would eat us. I doubt it's going to be this easy. Something awful is going to happen, I swear, guys. It's all right. Shh. No one will hurt you now. My hero. How do you feel? Your head. It... it talks to me. All the time now. And what does it say? It says... it wants me to join it. The first threshold. Tommy, I'm scared. We'll never get out of here. We don't have a choice. If I am with you, the voice, are you ready to reply? Oh, shit. For real? Are we going to use these rats? Hugo, oh, man. can you hear them? <laughs> yes. Do you have the same voice? The one that... <laughs> Makes my head hurt. Don't try to ignore it. Embrace it completely. 
Don't be afraid. Oh boy, here we go. Yes. Imperium, Hugo can now control rats. Hold the left trigger to aim, then hold the right trigger to call the rats to the designated area. Left trigger to aim, right trigger to call them. Okay. Uh, it's trying to tell us something else, but it's not fading out the top one. Not sure what the heck's going on. Okay. There we go. Left trigger to aim. You can't really see with it all. Let's maybe get him over here. Well done. Whoa. You see? It's like rat force powers. You have to hold in the trigger. Oh shit. My headache's gone. It was the macula, but you answered it. Let's get going. This is probably not the way to do this. But uh it worked. Holy shit, guys. We have rat force powers now. Come on. Find this document and get out of here. <laughs> All right, bitches. Funny, the coward. You're scared, aren't you? Oh, you this oh. is not a game. This ah. is Where are they? You have to control uh. yourself. Yeah, we have to yes, control man. ourselves. Let's control ourselves. Let's just control ourselves. Sick. Hugo. That's my disease. Jesus. You're not sick, Hugo. It's a, it's a gift. It's a gift. I'll later. It a seems gift. like quite a gift. How long can we use it for good? It's incredibly interesting, though. I never really expected to have direct control over the rats. Oh. Oh, maybe I'm going no, crazy. everything is good, man. I would totally break you out, too, if I were an adult and capable of those things. But I'm going to leave you here to rot instead. Um, okay, we can go that way. Can we get out of here? I don't know if we have the key, right? We got some keys. It's locked. It's locked. Let's keep looking. Okay, so we don't have that key. We just have a key to the cell. I wonder how long, how far off we can call them from. What the hell Probably have to be able to see them. Here? What the hell happened? They won't come into the light, even if we call them. So we still have to be pretty careful. Not too shabby, Hugo. Not too good job, Mom, for opening him up to his oh, rat these potential. Roads are in a terrible state. How are we gonna deliver this? All we need now is to lose one of these cages. Be careful. Um what okay, I think that if we just move this. They're not just gonna come out of there. Huh. It's just Okay, some of them did come out. I guess it was just them bugging through the wall. I'm not really sure. Oh, yes. Oh, I see. I see what we need to do. Let's just get move this totally out of the way. And then we can do what we need to do here. Get it over here. It's a good thing he can't hear this. I feel like we need some WD-40 before we start moving these with guards in the room, but they're all notoriously deaf. Rats! Rats! Black rats! Fuck! Help! Well done. These rats. What the hell did they do to them? They make them eat people's blood. Really? Yes. It's strange. I can feel the black rats, but 
Not these ones. Yeah, I don't. See. I don't know what they're doing. We need to find a way to get out of here. They're trying what to they to make rats friends? that we can't control or that don't have the plague or that don't aren't connected to our blood. And they surprisingly aren't all red-eyed and crazy. Like you know how we have rats that aren't red-eyed and crazy. So I wonder. Um, but let's try to get out of here, shall we? Oh no! Ah! Oh my shit. <laughs> you can't slip off the triggers or aim at anything. Like if you accidentally aim at like a crate, they're just gonna rush you. It's a little bit difficult to get used to for me. Uh and now like yeah, it's it's incredibly weird. Sometimes it works without a hitch. Other times it's like it just lets them in front of you, it doesn't keep pushing them back. Um, Alright, let's keep aiming at the ground way ahead of us. I want them to move further away. Let's, okay. That's better. If I stay stationary for a minute and get them far away, I can have better control over them. Oh my god, they're coming. Holy shit, okay. Cool. Oh. Alright. Alright, that didn't really get us where we wanted, actually. Holy shit. Okay, there's a lot of rats. They're not that easy to control. Even with our force powers. Are you still alright, Hugo? It feels a bit funny. It will make you tired. That's normal. Tell me if you feel poor. It'll make us yes. tired, yeah. It's just hard not to be able to see where we're going as we're backing up from them sometimes. Slow and steady. Slow and steady. Why do I know how to do this? It's... It's in your blood. Uh, it's the blood that decides. See? It's complicated to explain. But Amicia doesn't know. No. I'll explain later. Hmm. We had an argument, Mommy. I wonder how she's going to take right, this. It's my darling. Amicia. Let's get out of here, huh? Your brother can control the rats. Uh, how, do you, how do you take that? I guess you take it for what it's worth, which is useful. But I feel like people aren't going to react that way. Like when they find out you have weird rat force powers, their feelings about you might change. Whether they want them to or not. I, yeah, I get the feeling we just kind of like walked right into their hands. What do we do? Just enter the main cathedral? So, I don't, Beatrice. Does she lead us here? You are reunited with your son at last. I know what you have done to him. You have taken what you wanted, now let him go! Oh, you insult me, Madame de Rune. Your son is the natural carrier of the macula. And it has not yet finished with him. Which means, neither have I. But this you know. Vitalis, let us finish this. Nicolas, you cannot understand. This guy you is the Palpatine of the Rat Force. Do you not, boy? This is this guy's Palpatine. We are bound by blood now. What do you think, Hugo? Your family grows larger. I think you're psycho. That's what I've always thought. I beg of you. I promise to help you, but allow my son to leave. His destiny is not. To be a Darun. His destiny is to be here at my side. You are a monster. A monster? Madame, you have yet to see just how. Oh boy, now what? Oh, we got this. Kill her. 
Perhaps you make it quick Correct. and clean. It's Say goodbye to way. your mother, boy. Don't hurt her. Oh, oh God. We've turned to the dark side. We're turning. Attack. Kill her. What do I do? The Where are they? Where are they? I don't see anybody. I'm having a huge problem with that. Oh, okay, great. Well, I got one of them. They're, they blend into the goddamn walls I, or something. I did the whole circuit, didn't see them. This seems easy enough once we get the cadence of it. Yeah, we're gonna skip this, obviously. Oh, I make it quick and clean. Say goodbye to your way. mother, boy. Don't hurt her. <laughs> All right, and they're probably gonna come from the left now. Sorry, Shuko. Attack! Kill her! Hey, what do I do? I have the honor Attack. of killing the carrier's mother. Just a you child. Wish she's mine. Ah. You don't have a home anymore. You are ours. God. You are the beginning of Don't the conjuration. The future depends on you. Uh, yeah, making him do all this is probably not great. I don't know. Oh my god, guys. Anything that Amicia did, we're doing worse now. I'll tell you everything you want to know. It's too late. Come on! The child is weakening! Yes! Devour them! I saw the way through! Goes to the other side! No, Hugo, don't listen to him! Ah, god damn it! Let me do the whole secret again. Ah, the whole thing again.